here with an outro chat. Um, there's a warning here coming in. I didn't think we'd be going on again. This is a warning, you guys. I see someone here. This is your ex. Let's just someone here they're thinking of showing up to where you're at some of you you deliberately moved away from this person they're gonna hit you up and they're gonna be like hey where are you at these days and i feel like it's so simple as your 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 role here is to literally just deny this person wait stay alex stay. wait 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 alex wait serious case of cut cuddly going on right now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> cuddly waddles. It's a cuddly waddly. Fast. Hi, boobies. Featuring Alex. So, yeah, guys. This person, like, they're gonna try to show up. Like, some of you, they're shameless. They're shameless. They're shameless. They may literally, like, try... Some of you, it's like, you told them, hey, I'm not really interested. Like, you're trying to give clues. Okay, they're gonna be like, oh, I'll hit you up later. It's okay, I'll try again. It's like, I'm not reading between the lines. Some of you, you moved on. Okay, this person just has a warning. Like, some of you, you do not want this person showing up because you don't want them messing with your new relationship. And this person here, I see them coming in. Okay, like, their lips me, you're at a diner. I don't know what's at the diner, but this is what's coming through. This person is. watch or some kind of techie watch they're gonna try to bust like your reunion uh they heard you're having a reunion with someone else they want to show up it's like they heard you're going on a first date they they want this is someone who's really uh, possessive over your energy i don't know if you know but yeah Here, what are you doing here yeah this guy's gonna show up guys i see he's gonna come to the restaurant you're at if you thought this person had shame, oh no. Um, okay, what's he doing? He's he's hiding in the in the restroom for some people go to the paparazzi. Oh my god. Someone is dealing with something here. Some of you, you even went so far as to like try and get off the grid, like you went into a cave. You're like hanging out in a cave or something. This person freaking finding you. I'm hearing something about an SUV. Guys, like, seriously, do be aware. Do not share your personal information. This person here, he's acting like he has the right to be there, too. It's like, what? I'm hungry, too. It's like, I could be here. It's like, you're you're clearly being, like, a stalker. Okay, with something like that. Some of you, the authorities, honestly. Um... Some. This is not for everybody. I'm hearing, what are you doing? Like, I told, oh my god, some of you, this is like, he, he, he's gonna show up at your new place. Oh no. Oh my god, I'm sorry, I have to show you this. Do you guys see Alex's TVs? Oh my god! <laughs> oh no, the look was so cute. No, I'm gonna make a funny Alex. That was really cute though. Oh my god, I don't know if you guys caught it. What, I'm allowed to be here? I can hang out here too. It's like, oh my god, okay, but like, god. It's like, he knows that y'all are like getting, y'all are getting like serious together. You happen to show up right when we're like pulling out custard. We're at the dessert part of the dinner, like. Oh. Okay, go on, like, I'm listening. Then what? <laughs> Listening, okay. Like, can't promise I won't get distracted, but like, yeah, I'm basically listening, okay. <laughs> basically, like, <sighs> he's not really gonna show up, is he? It's like, yes, it's like, uh, Alex, are you spilling the beans with someone here? It's like, oh, I don't think I am. It's like, y'all have a friend maybe spilling the beans on your new address. 
like, bro, I hid that on Facebook for a re- for a- for a re- No, I, I see somebody gonna get pissed at someone. I see you going a bit Dionysus in the diner. No, my milkshake does not bring no boys to the yard, like, unless I let them- Yeah, I have my details, like, some of you, you got, like, people showing up at your place. <laughs> Who are all these people? Some of you, like, your friend kind of, like, invited their friends over. So we heard, like, yeah, you guys are serving dinner and, like, burgers and milkshakes. Like, excuse me? I did not say that. So you're gonna- this could be a big problem, like, a legal issue. Okay? Yeah. So, someone here, like, I don't know if you have a friend who is trying to get involved. Like... You know, like they're kind of being an accomplice. Okay. Like to, to this other person. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know if that's clear. Whatever. I see some of you gonna get into a brawl in the diner. This could be a past life energy. Maybe you're in cough, cough. Like, maybe you feel there's people are conspiring. It's like, so how did they get my new address? Like, wow, this is really annoying, guys. Like, someone cannot be, they're not trustworthy. That's clear. They cannot be trusted. Someone here is showing up wearing Louis Vuittons. Maybe you're throwing an event, a party, and it's like, so who told, like, who, what? Like, wow, okay. No, I realize, like, someone here is a saboteur, clearly. Someone here has gone rogue, y'all. for this Astro Trine Alley. <laughs> okay, like, I'm listening. What? <laughs> no, I didn't really tell them. I just told them that... <laughs> no, I didn't tell them. Don't worry. It's like, are you, like, are you, like, for real right now? Oh, my God, what? It's, like, more people showing up. Like, so I heard, like, yeah, you're getting, like, something, something. Trying to feel this weird bombardment of energy. So maybe it's because you're elevating. It's a metaphor. I'm hearing Dawn of the Dead. Oh yeah. It's like you feel like all these energies from the past coming up. So we heard you be elevating. It's like yeah, that's that reading without their luggage. Mm -hmm. Without their luggage in your luggage, just got stray. It's not even just their bullshit or their karma. It's just a whole luggage. They wanted to do a Russian doll with your luggage. Do you know how unfair that is? Let's think about that. They want to put their luggage in your luggage. Where is all your stuff gonna go? Mm, I wonder. This person here, yeah. This is entities, these people. Alright, like, we can talk about it later. Like, right now I just want to sleep. It's like, okay. <laughs> Maybe he's literally channeling. He wants some time. <laughs> Maybe he thinks I'm talking to him. Alright. Anyways. So. I'll cover his ears with the blanket. <laughs> the blankie. It's okay, just don't talk. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so, um, there's something going on, like, okay. This has been the message, like, they caught, they caught wind, they caught wind. It's like, you're wondering, like, where are all these, like, weird entities and energies go? Like, because you never really have maybe met these people. Maybe it's like, oh, yeah, I remember I did tell them. <laughs> it's kind of like me. All right, but, yeah, okay. So, anyways, guys, like, Maybe your friends, like, they're not really, they don't have the best spiritual hygiene. They're letting kind of entities in for some. Some of you, like, someone let someone in from the front door. But they didn't, I mean, they don't even know. You guys don't let strangers into your house. This you're throwing a party. I see someone, like, they're trying to sell you a vacuum at your front door. So to tell a telemarketer, yeah, well, a house, it's a door to door sales rep. I see, like, he wants to, like, walk in and take a look around. Oh, it could be a metaphor. Mm. Yeah, he's trying, yeah, he's gonna help you clean up, clean 
cleanup, but he's bringing the mess. He's bringing a whole mess of, yeah, con Carmex. He's bringing a whole mess. It's a metaphor like, your house wasn't that dirty, you don't need this, like, mega turbo Swiffer, Hoover. He's like, he's gonna come in, cause a ruckus, cause a muck with his shoes. He's gonna drag his shoes in a bunch of mud with some with a bunch of, you know, dust and dirt, and then he's gonna vacuum it, and then he's gonna sell you on the vacuum. It's like, I don't know, there's something like going on with that, guys. Maybe this is a metaphor. Just like, look at this metaphor. But he wants to, like, hook up with you as well. It's like, this is, I see shark teeth here. It's different layers within layers, like, this person is trying, I'm seeing Mr. Potato Head, he's trying to come in, like, maybe different back doors. I'm hearing Alicia. told you like maybe he was even playing hard to get like i'm not that into you and then it's like he's coming back he's pretending he has a reason like some financial reason no no like this guy's a player for some of you and you know it so i see a slice of pineapple the energies are really off yeah so um mercury's Mercury going direct, still push out retro, with Pluto still retro, right? It's gonna be retro. Yeah, someone here is like dishonest with you guys. I don't hate to say that, like I feel that. We'll, we'll say us. And yeah. And I feel like there's someone here who let this person in, and it's like now you feel like it's messy. Like now I gotta figure out, like, who the hell did this mess here? Because mm. I feel you had a very, you have strong hygiene, spiritually. So it's like, why would this per why would I suddenly start having also. There's something about an energy that is like suddenly appearing maybe in context that it never did maybe for instance you start arguing with your partner and it's like who's who let's, let's back it up yeah um it could be your partner for some of you i'm hearing that um there's some influences here like especially if there's any drinking or drug involvement i'm seeing for some of you that there's especially high cyber activity cyber hmm. Uh, and uh, internet I activity within that specifically. A lot of trolls, a lot of demonic energies. <sighs> Probably to target the most susceptible. And, um, I'm hearing soul bearers. I see a fly. They're definitely on the prowl and the hunt. So maybe your partner, um, or someone here, you know. Something about onions. It could also be, um. Yeah, I see someone brought something in. This is someone at your house, like at your place. Excuse me, you kind of feel. He's kind of bringing, like, something of a. I don't know. It's got a sense to it. Like, ever since he brought that thing to our house, like, it's weird. Um, some of you, it's, yeah, something awkward. Um, it's like he brings a welcome mat, but the, it has bugs on the bottom side of it. It's not like an, maybe, yeah, it's not a new mat. Like, he's bring, yeah, this is a, definitely a message for someone of generational karma as well. So maybe you have to, you, you gotta cut something off, like, uh. I don't resonate with that. Mm -hmm. Maybe this is an older friend. It's like you're trying to cut ties, and then your uh, your other friend or someone here, like, yeah, I could swear, like, I see these sea monsters. You know, like in the char characterizations of the cat of the old castle with a I'm hearing the name Tyler with a big river around it like a, a river that encircles and in order to leave the castle you have to cross the bridge and then you see those sea monsters that wiggle in between the waves yeah i see that right there they almost look like otters but like s s sea snakes oh let's clear the throat oh my god let's back it up sea snakes yeah but like really big i'm hearing who the hell like brought him here some of you this is an entity it's like, I don't want to hang out with him. I never said nothing. Like, this is someone here. 
It's like they're a lost, like, trap. Ugh, let's clear the energy. Maybe it's even... if you're having people visit. Oh, oh. Let's just bow them. Something not right with the energy they're bringing into your home, your space. You definitely want to do some saging. Um, especially if someone has been, like, traveling. I see someone bringing in... I see something about loafers. Maybe it's a pair of shoes. Maybe a pair of shoes, like... Okay, maybe it's, but I feel like for some of you this isn't even a gift. We were just saying something on the community tab about that, but anyways, Spirit has been so active today. Um, I've definitely been over posting and over commenting and community tabbing uh, somewhat, but some, oh, I'm hearing some of you, this person has an addiction. I'm hearing something about snorting cocaine. Maybe you didn't know this. Some of you soon may have the flu. I'm here with some of Republican. Maybe it's a metaphor. It's like maybe your your cousin even or your your friend. Someone here is starting to bring in like an energy. Like maybe they're watching a new TV show. There's just something like you will know. It's a very distinct. It's like an energy. It's a, it's like a smell in the air. It's like. I feel like you are, like, talking to someone. I hear that. Hmm. Um. Yes. I see a piglet statue. Like, yeah, something is, um. Yeah. I'm hearing something about the phone like maybe you're talking on the phone but then maybe you meet up and it's like you're feeling something when you're around them in person you're feeling something in person i'm hearing donovan Don donald donald donnie whoa i see a big bright fret red light like a big full like a strong light almost like red red <sighs> so maybe this is your ex, you know, and maybe you're like wondering why do I feel this person energy, but some of you they're showing up like for real, for literals, like for literals, like where you're at. So just don't post, don't share. This person may try to crop up and be like, what a coincidence. Like we're both here at the same time. This is not a coincidence. He was watching your, yeah, your gram. So maybe you think this person not watching, they're watching through an alias. Let's go. Some of you, you know, just don't be very vigilant with your postings, okay? Especially if it's just general, like this person. So we got Mallorca. I'm here in Amadeus. Let's just, mm, let's back it up. Oh my god. Uncle Cracker? What's that song? That's the song from earlier I was thinking of. Uh, I, think it was, uh, I think it was the Capricorn reading. But anyways. I see a boat. Ugh. I don't know, guys. Something is creepy, even. So you're just not feeling comfortable around someone. It's like they're bringing in a whole. You know. I see, like. It's like a snake line of entities. Some of you, this is someone who's coming into your home. You may need to sage this person down. Some of you, you may need to, like, really even say a prayer or do a clearing or a cleansing, like, um, 
it could be a metaphor okay as well like maybe you are not ready to get involved with this person because you're not sure if you guys are really truly in alignment and so clearing is yeah clarifying that as well as very important we'll see that